Hello everyone, it's Brett here, Lionheart84, and I just thought I'd do this quick video. This is my yellow cherry guava. It's been inside for about a week now. It's in my front room in the window, and you can see that some of the fruits are going yellow, although most of them are still green. Um, some of them are actually ripening up on the plant. However, I'm also getting fairly substantial fruit drop each day from fruits that haven't ripened or aren't um, aren't ripe enough to eat. Um, I'm picking up about three or four a day and this is what happens obviously when you bring them inside and you move them into the dry household atmosphere. I've kept it well hydrated just in case it was due to lack of water but I think it's more likely to be the dry atmosphere because as you can see there's a dry there's a radiator and the plant's only a short distance from it and obviously that radiates a lot of heat with the central heating on but looks like some of them are going to make it to ripeness on the plant that one dark yellow color looks like it's fully edible um, these aren't noted these fruits for ripening once they've come off the plant uh, however, I'll probably put these on the fruit bowl next to banana just on the off chance they ripen and soften a bit and are edible. But I thought that might be interest people who are following the progress of my tropical plants once they're indoors. That's my yellow cherry or lemon uh, yellow uh, lemon cherry guava. Obsidium cattleyanum. I think it's. Uh, either literally or lucidum is a yellow variety depending on uh, which books you read anyway thanks for watching much appreciate it please give me a thumbs up share the video if you think it might be useful to anyone subscribe to my channel and remember to click on the bell to get updates on the progress of my plants through winter as i put videos out catch up with you all soon brett out for now